I've never been in that situation before where, you know, I'm meeting tons of people at one time and we all have the same goal of, you know, trying to steal someone's girl. Not at all. Um, you know, even in my everyday life, you know, I come across girls who have boyfriends and I think there's nothing wrong with getting to know the girl still. And you never know a friendship can come out of it, you know. But, you know, on the island, everyone's there for a reason. So it is what it is. I didn't I didn't take any, you know, I didn't feel bad about it, really. I'm gonna say right off the bat, uh, Iris. Iris was very pretty, cute, smaller girl. Um, and she just, I could just tell she had a sweet vibe to her, you know, real genuine down to earth girl. Um, and then you could see all the dudes were pointing to her. I mean, she just stuck out right away. So Ash was the first girl I spoke to at the mixture. Um, she was talking to some of the guys and I just put her to, aside and I said, you know, Ash, I really want to talk to you, um, you know, get to know you a little bit better. This will be our first day meeting. Um, and we did hit it off. We had a lot of connections, a lot of things in common. And, um, you know, right off the bat, I could tell she was a very interesting and cool girl. After that convo, I could just tell that Ash, you know, she wears her heart on her sleeve and that's really respectable. And you know, admirable. I told her I respect her a lot. Um, you know, it's not easy to come to the island and put yourself out there like that. Um, you know, and I could just tell she was a great girl, and I, I told her that. So I feel like you're the type too. You you wear your heart in your sleeve, also. So like that that makes sense that you would. See I that. do. You know, that's the way to live. You know, you don't want to hold anything back. We did. We spoke a bit more. Um, but there were some things that happened um, that kind of had me take a step back and you know assess the situation a little bit. I mean, you can see in the clip when Ash told me that um, he introduces her as you know his friend. I was like, mm. I really didn't even know what to say. It's like, why are you even with this guy? You know. But, you know, I always say, you don't know all the details of people's relationships. I don't want to be too quick to judge. You know, we've all been there. But I don't know, right off the bat, I thought, okay, he's a bit of a problem. I'll be honest, it was very intriguing. The concept was a little weird, you know, out of the ordinary, but I liked the challenge. You know, a lot of single dudes, only four girls, and they have boyfriends, so, I just thought it was a challenge and it would bring the best out of me and, and you know, help me discover more of who I am, you know? Um, it, it was just exciting though, um, yeah. I was, I wanna say, oh, I need the singles. Oh, oh yeah, there was plenty, you know, pretty singles. Um, Marissa, very pretty, Alexa, you know, Karina was nice, you know, she's very pretty, but, I think they did a good job casting the singles. Um, very pretty people. I can't lie, Deke's a stud. He's a good looking guy. He's very confident. I think all of us had a little bit of nerves, but at the same time, you know, I know the kind of guy I am and what I bring to the table. So I'm never afraid of the competition. I'll tell you what, that night, you know, I don't want to say too much, but it was definitely interesting. And um, I had seen Deke before, you know, on season two, and I know the kind of guy he is. So when I saw him, I knew right off the bat that things were going to get interesting, you know? Can you give us any, 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 any teasers? Any teasers? Any teasers? Let's just say Deke is not afraid to act on what he wants. How about that? I will say, this is what I loved about Deke. He was, even though he was very confident, he was a very cool guy. And he told us to just um, not hold back. And whatever we feel like saying in the moment, say it, you know, cause on the island, anything goes, you know? So I did, I did like that about him. He was very encouraging, um, but yeah. I genuinely did. Um, I just, I know the type of guy I am. I know the, you know, the people that I attract. 
And I didn't think it would be that big of a problem meeting someone and at least building a connection with someone. That's tough. Um, before the show, I was wondering like who, what couple would go on the show. But after going through it, I see that couples really want to test their relationships and see if it is fit for them, you know? And the island is a great way to do that. It's an, an, or, uh, it's an unorthodox way to do that. But it's, it's a way to do that. And I got to see everyone progress in their journeys. And, you know, me personally, I don't know if I would bring my girl on the island, but I can see why people do. Um, I've never been in that situation before where, you know, I'm meeting tons of people at one time and we all have the same goal of, you know, trying to steal someone's girl or, you know, at least build a connection with them. So I learned a lot about myself. I think it was very beneficial for me. A lot of plot twists, a lot, and everyone loves a good plot twist, right? No one likes to know what's about to happen. Um, but I will say the cast individually, crazy characters on there, um, a lot of energy and a lot of excitement coming y'all's way.